Well, hello everybody. Um, the name is Boyd712, known in game as Zantej, and welcome to my first official Smite commentary. Today I will be playing as Loki because I have this friend who really likes, um, who's a big fan of Loki and the Thor movies and well I just figured she'd like this video so this one's for you Rose. So I'm just buying a few items and then I'm gonna start laning. So just reply to this chat. So I'm going to be laning with Chunga. And that's why I've bought Watcher's Gift, because she, she's going to be able to clear out minion waves significantly better than me. So, because I bought Watcher's Gift, um, that will give me all the gold and XP as if I was farming myself. Because just typically Loki doesn't farm too well. So, yeah. I, I'm actually assisting in farming a bit, that's why I put a skill point in my two. Because that'll clear out some minion waves, but all the same, it's better. It's... Um, I'm going to focus on ranking up my one and my three, and of course my ultimate, um, as soon as I possibly can. So I'm actually going to level up pretty quickly. I'm just going to call out the missing call. Okay, wait a minute. So, are we ain't lining against Cupid and Artemis? This could be very good. The thing I've noticed about their team, they're all squishies. Which is very interesting. I am just going to turn down the volume of this game because it's a bit loud. So, that's a bit better. I can hear myself think now. Yeah, I'm leveling at a decent pace, which is good. Mm. So I'll just put that decoy there, that'll blob, take out the minions. Well, not completely. This Chunga is good, she's really helping me. Eh. Taking a lot of minion damage heal up. Okay. Okay, Cupid has arrived. Retreat right lane. What? Enemy missing left. Hopefully I can scare him Enemy off. Missing left. Yeah, he's gone. Hey, it's Loki. Oh, no. Okay. Okay. Well, we survived that. All four of them ganked to the lane at once. That was just frightening. I don't know how he lasted that. Not very effective gankers. Okay. Oh, I'm level three. Got a point in my one. Um, in my one and my three. And that's my primary combo. I should be able to do some pretty serious damage to the enemy. Won't be anything too special, but it'll be enough to be significant. Enemy missing left. So Enemy missing left. Enemy missing right. Just call out that. Because Artemis still isn't here. Retreat. Your retreats under attack. Hmm, yeah, let's just get back out of here. Oh, we've got more minions coming through. Retreat. Okay, so if that's the composition of the enemy team and they're all physical except for our Kwong, who's going who's probably going mid, then this could be an easier game than I thought, just on the grounds that our team is more balanced. Your Not by much, I'm the only physical, but we at least have Hades tanking for us. So, oh, okay, that's a problem. Hades went down. Okay, I'm not going to aggress 
while Chunga isn't here. So that would be stupid. No, I don't want to risk my neck. They've got that box for a jungling for them. So that's interesting. So. Ah, Alright. So just yesterday I received a tip that when you see those little circles on the ground, it means you're in melee range. <laughs> so that's going to help me a lot. Coordinating my attack. Whoa, what happened? Must have gotten greedy. Anubis got himself killed by a tower. See, he was probably tower diving to grab a kill on someone else. And then ended up dying to the tower. So that's unfortunate. Ah, that's not good. Let's not take random tower damage. So yeah, I'm leveling up pretty well thanks to Watcher's Gift. Which, as far as Loki concern, is concerned, is very important. Because if I want to be a, ma a major threat in this game, I need to deal a lot of damage. And I can't deal that much damage at a low level, and when I don't have enough gold. Now, next chance I get, I'm going to go back to base and buy Ninja Tabai. And that's going to actually give me a critical strike chance. And I know it's just 7%. But without it, I have no chance of critting at all. And better I have some chance of critting than no chance of critting. So, left lane already has a tower down, that's good. And I'll just sneak out of here as best I can. Whoa! Okay, he got me there. I didn't even see him there. Hmm. Well, that's unfortunate. They're getting more kills than we are, but they have terrible push. So that's one thing to consider. He really took me by surprise there. I didn't have any reaction time. Same, yeah. Hades has the only kill on our team. Well, that's not terrible. Now that I have my ultimate ability, I can start getting some kills of my own. Because that stun is really more valuable than you'd think. And Cupid is just at low enough health that I could probably get it if he'd come out of tower range. An enemy has been slain. Okay, I'll just dodge those arrows of his. Okay, I'll wait for him to do that again. Trap him outside tower range. But no, uh, he's healing up a decent amount. I'll just let Chunga do the work for now. So long as I stay near her, I'm leveling up about as fast as her. Okay, she's returning to base to get some mana. Okay. So, that little icon there's flashing, so I can go An back by Ninja Tabai, that's good. Not really in range to make a move on Cupid yet, and I'd ideally like him to be at lower health before I try. But, I don't know, we'll see. See what I can do. Your middle tower is under attack. Your left tower is under attack. Okay, Artemis actually has some fierce push down left lane. That could be a problem for us. And what's Agni doing over here? Whoa! Okay, we've got a gank. Okay. See, they're in tower range. There's no point trying to make a move. We'll probably just end up swapping kills anyway. I mean, I could probably almost I could probably get that kill on Bakasura, but there isn't much of a chance that I'd get out again. So we'll just see if he comes out. See if he's got the guts. Come out and try to get the kill. I don't think he does. So Arnus actually has that tower down. Huh? 
worrying. Okay, it's dark. Okay, you know what? I think... I'll just use my ult to teleport out quickly. Heh. Secured that kill pretty easily. Okay. That wasn't terrible. Oh, some nice push from him. And now they've retreated a bit, we can get this tower down in a few seconds. And... Oh, it looks like Artemis has done the same thing. Artemis and their Loki. Okay. Just rank up my ultimate ability. This game is actually progressing rather quickly. They've pushed down a whole lane of ours already. I need to get out of here. Okay, Cupid's back, and he's targeting me again. Okay, I'll just heal up a bit. Hopefully Chunga will get the idea. Yeah, she's healing me. Farm off these creeps. Cupid's behind us, right. Get out of there! Ah! Okay, I really need to escape. Huh. What's this Al Kwong doing? I could probably pull off a nasty gank. An ally has been slain. Leave him in the dust. An ally has been slain. Yep. Down he goes. An ally has been oh, slain. wow, a bit Double too late for Agni there. Your middle tower is under attack. It's a shame I couldn't save him, but at least I got that kill. Your right tower is under attack. Oh, they're pushing down that tower. I'll just grab some potions and head back on out. So I'm building up a decent amount. I'm focusing on building attack speed and critical chance. And if I do that, I'll be pretty good for the game. Okay, they've, they've got that tower down. There's no way we can stop them. They're screaming it. Okay, so this is the thing. We're up against so many physical car carries and just 80 characters that if we leave for even a second, they can get down a tower. Because they are that strong. Your middle tower is under attack. So now we need to take advantage of them not being here. And we need to get down this tower. Well, there's going to be a serious imbalance here. And Haney's just taking over Bakasura over there. Neither one on low on health enough, but there's cause of concern. Whoa, okay, he's been... Oh, whoa. They all just focused him. That's a problem. Okay, well... Let's make sure he didn't die in vain. And we get down this tower. Okay. They go in. I go in. Agni has some nice harass up there. Okay. I think they're all mid right now. Just by the look of the mini-map, they're probably all mid. So... Need a bit more gold. Um... Just tell him not to push that phoenix, because it could just get a bit dangerous and leaves us really open. Yeah. Well, she sees Cupid, I don't need to tell her about him. Okay, yeah, she's trying something. Ah, okay. Bit slow on the evade, but... Yeah, that worked. He didn't do much to us. I might just grab speed while I'm here. I actually don't I think so. Just based on the fact that it saves you the money of buying mana potions if you can manage your resources well enough. 
and they need to stop stepping into those dragons. And we've surrendered. Well, that's too bad, but hey, mm, nice short game. Pretty good. I did pretty well. Five and one, help wherever I could. So, yeah. Unfortunate, but I guess these things happen. So, good game. Well played, guys. I actually think I had the best Katie. Yeah, I had the best kill death ratio on the team. So that's a bit sad because I'm not exactly the best Loki in the world. So, yeah, that's an episode, guys. See you next time.